What's up guys? I'm here to help you with the no mods found issue that you guys are having with Magic Launcher. A lot of you have told me that you've had all sorts of problems with this error message, no mods found, and until now I haven't really known what the best way is to fix this, and I did find that out like a week ago, and it's it basically I posted this pretty vague list of steps to help you get things moving and a lot of you still had problems so now I have found a mod that demonstrates the issue and then I know the solution and so now I'm going to help you so first off we're going to use a mod that is probably fairly complicated usually mods that show up no mods found in magic launcher are very complicated mods millionaire which is a minecraft village mod as you can see in the browser window is one of those mods and so you want to go to the forum page or the actual home page for the website or for the mod and that's here at millionaire.org this it goes for any other mod that has this issue just go ahead and download the newest one you have for minecraft 1.2.5 or whatever version of minecraft you're using make sure it is the exact same version and as you can see it's uh, right here so you would want to click that I've already got uh, the older one, but I'll use it. doesn't matter. It's the same thing. So, millionaire 2.7.7.zip is what I have. And so, we're going to try to use this in Magic Launcher. So, we're going to start Magic Launcher. And we're going to go to Setup. Okay. Ignore all this stuff right here, and we're going to add the one from the desktop Let's see we got millionaire 2.7.7.zip and that's the one that we want to use and this is where we're going to run into our problem and it says no mods found a lot of you have gotten right here gotten stuck don't know what to do you've asked me a million times and I'm like yo I don't know and now I'm like yo I do know right I do know and so don't don't just get stuck right here and ask me a bunch of questions because I'm going to tell you exactly what to do. So you're going to go back to your Finder window or your uh, Windows Explorer, and you're going to open up this Millionaire zip file or any mod file doesn't matter any zip file that you download for a mod, and you're going to open up that folder, and you're going to look in there and you're going to see a bunch of mess. You're going to see a bunch of stuff. You may not know what it does or what it means or anything. What does the world mean? I don't know. 42. Uh, and you're going to go to the one that says to put this inside the Minecraft.jar. So this one right here it says put in Minecraft.jar. All the others have different destinations. And so the ones that you're going to put inside Minecraft.jar, if you are normally installing these, these mods, you would open it up. You select all of the mods. And you can even take these out although I'm I don't think that's a hundred percent percent necessary but you just want to select all these right all of the class files right click compress it's pretty much the same thing on Windows then you're gonna rename this so you know what it okay not open it but you're gonna rename it gonna rename it whatever the mod is Millionaire uh, mods found. Yes, they are found. Woohoo. So the mods are found. Okay, and we can put this on the desktop. And now we're going to remove this one because we know it does not work. We're going to go back to our desktop or wherever you have it. Downloads, doesn't matter. You're going to find the one that says Millionaire mods found. Or whatever you called it. You're going to open it. And that sucker is going to work. So, again, this is just an issue of organization structure that Magic Launcher kind of isn't the greatest at. It can only read one uh, one level deep, and that sucks. But you know we have to live with it. So, if you have a complicated mod, a mod that does a lot of different things, I would really suggest to first try it out in Magic Launcher normally. You know, just go ahead and see if it works that way. If it says no mods found, don't worry. 
you can go ahead and do exactly what I said. Basically, you're going to open that zip. You're going to have a folder. Inside that folder, you might have another folder that says put this inside the Minecraft.jar or just any class files that you find. You're going to want to zip all those class files. Zip them. Not any folders, but zip those, those class files. And then you're going to use that in Magic Launcher. Everything else, we'll go back to back to where this was. Everything else that says put in Minecraft folder or put in mods folder or put in the resources folder, you're going to want to do that separately too. Because some mods will have resources that need to be loaded in the resource folder, not in the actual jar. So if you have a complicated mod, just make sure you watch this video and it should help you. Thanks. I'll see you guys in the next video.